Welcome everyone to our 2020 webinar annual UCC BCom convention. I hope everyone enjoyed series one of our convention, our interview with Shane from PwC and Armina, a current BCom student. We are now moving on today to series number two of our convention, and I'm delighted to have Kerry Gleason, a BCom graduate who is now senior accounts manager with Soder Winds, an IT company, and Callum McLaughlin, a current student, with us today. Today, I'd like to focus on two main advantages of the unique BCom design, even though there are many. I want to focus on an advantage from a student's point of view and an advantage from a graduate's point of view. From a student's point of view, students are not asked to pick their specialization until year four. At that stage, they would have taken modules in all the majors that are on offer and therefore can make a more informed decision. And we find students are more confident to be able to identify their intended career path. From a graduate's point of view, the advantage to them is that a student graduates with a specialization in a business major. However, they also have a broad knowledge base of all the other business areas that they decided not to specialize in. My two guests today, Kerry and Callum, have first-hand experiences of these two advantages. Kerry, a BCom graduate, who is now Senior Accounts Manager with Solar Winds, would have majored in our Human Resource major in year four. Kerry finds a great benefit from having taken an array of information system modules and data analysis modules in the early years of the BCom. And Kerry now finds that she can manage more effectively given that she has a solid understanding of the environment in which she operates within. As a graduate, Kerry, who's been in the employment market for a good few years now, looking back on the BCom program, what are your views on the design of the program? Well, first of all, thank you very much for having me today. Um, it's, it's, it's really great actually speaking with people from, from UCC and keeping that contact years later. Um, I couldn't recommend the BCom program enough, um, particularly in UCC. It's a really highly respected, well-known degree. Um, and that was one of my reasons for picking the degree. Um, I wasn't 100% sure what exactly I wanted to do. And I felt that given the wide range of modules as you've gone through just there that were available to me to kind of test and try out, um, the different um, modules throughout the years that it would kind of give me a good opportunity just to decide what I wanted to do over time. Um, again, as I said, I couldn't recommend it enough. Um, went into first year, just absolutely loved it. Um, the support that's there to you as a student as you go throughout the years in UCC, particularly in the BCom degree, is absolutely, it's excellent. It's absolutely excellent. Um, and as you go along then, let's say from first year on to second year, you can kind of tailor the program to your strengths. So you start to kind of figure out where your, your strengths are throughout the program, which subjects you might be stronger in other than others. You know, you might still have an interest in other areas, but may not want to major in them further down the line. So you still kind of get a taste of everything and kind of picking the credits that you want to study then going forward. Callum and I would have had many chats a few years ago when Callum was actually grappling with the decision of whether to engage in a very specific business degree program or to choose a more broad-based business degree program which also offered a specialization in year four. <coughs> And I'm delighted to say Callum chose the latter. Um, Callum, as a current student who's in the middle of the BCom program at the moment, 
what are your views on the design of the program? And would you feel your fellow students would concur with that opinion? Just to elaborate on what you mentioned at the start, um, when I first came to UCC, we had a few discussions about um, me looking at a different course other than commerce. Um, and you just said, take your time, you know, look at, look at all of what commerce, um, you know, provides you with all the opportunities and all the knowledge. Um, and I'm really delighted that I stuck, you know, with it for a few months because I think that the design of the program is second to none. Um, it's part of the reason why it's so well known as a course um, in Ireland and abroad. Um, I think what's great about it is that due to the fact that you don't specialize too early on, you only, you know, specialize in fourth year, that by the time you're making your decision for your major, you can make a really informed decision um, as to what area of business you want to go into. So um, I, from quite a young age, for example, have been quite interested in the banking sector. So I never would have thought about um, marketing really or IS and supply chains, but um, they've been really, really vital to help my decision making now going forward into third year after studying those modules I know that actually they're really interesting topics that I wouldn't mind working in those areas and if um, and, and even if I was to say end up in the banking sector or the accountancy area it, it's still very important to understand supply chains and supply chain management and the effect that information systems has on companies because even if you're not in that area, they, they can affect these companies that you might be looking at and interested in working with. Um, then to the point of um, my, my um, fellow BCom uh, students, I think we, we actually discuss the program on quite a regular basis. Um, and, and I think everybody really loves the fact that you don't specialize because even if you're committing yourself early on and that you think you'll go into a certain area, you're still going to get um, knowledge that will really stick with you for your career. And then of course, you're also studying with people who are in the same program, but may end up in different areas. And that's, that's great. That's already building your network for when you graduate, which is invaluable into the future. Fantastic. Thank you, Callum. And Kerry, you've won many awards in your time some during um, the BCom program and then others as a graduate in the employment market. I think the most recent being um, the Ireland and UK Top Trainee Consultant Award and many congratulations on that. Um, I would just like to ask, how do you see where did the BCom actually help you achieve such success so early on in your career? It was third year in place of placement in commerce and I decided to do my placement with a car rental company called Enterprise Rent-A-Car and they had a, a, a graduate program then rolled out so um, initially I was employed as an intern with them when I was in third year in commerce and the opportunity was there then to come back and work for them after I completed my commerce degree. So, you know, from the get-go, once I got in, I was competing for um, an Intern of the Year award with them, which again, you know, the, obviously the end result would be that a job was there available to me once I completed fourth year, which was, you know, for that, um, you know, I worked extremely hard to make sure that I was able to open that opportunity to me. Um, and also then... As part of that, if you were successful and you actually won the Intern of the Year Award, you got to travel with the company and work for them abroad. Um, so I was really keen to travel to the States, particularly San Francisco, and the company gave me the opportunity to do that. So with them, um, particularly in the area that I was interested in, it was kind of a, was the management side of things. So I got to... Um, as part of that um, intern placement, I got to experience um, different areas of the business and found my strengths was, was more so on the sales side of things. Um, really enjoyed, you know, engaging with customers, um, business development. Um, and then as I worked my way up, I went from intern to trainee to management assistant and I returned to Ireland then as an assistant manager and kind of worked my way up from there. Um, 
after that, I joined, then again, I kind of wanted to specialize in sales. So all the way through, you're kind of figuring out, you know, where, where your strong points are. Um, and from there, then I decided to join a recruitment consultant company. So I was more kind of going into the consultancy route while keeping kind of my sales background and having that engagement with people on a day to day basis. Um, after a couple of years, then um, I decided to move back to Cork from Dublin and um, loved Cork, particularly from my days in UCC and joined SolarWinds. Um, and that's where I began an account manager. So again, you know, a, a quite a varied role um, dealing with customers on a day to day basis um, business development, sales, um, accounts. Um, so it's, it's taken a lot from what I learned in the BCom program into my day to day job to this day another point to mention was something when you were chatting to Callum um particularly like a, a benefit of the the BCom program when you're talking about subjects but also just to keep in mind you're not specializing yourself to industry so that's really important coming out of the BCom program because like even looking at the market at the moment you know a lot of my friends are in various industries so you could have an accountant as an example but they could be an accountant in an IT company they could be an accountant in something else so you're not limiting yourself to the industry thank you so much Kerry and you've been so successful and as I said before so early on in your career and Callum similar to Kerry you're no stranger to winning awards yourself um, again very early on in in the BCom degree program could you tell us a bit about the award that you won last year, Callum, as a BCom student? Sure. So um, in my first year in commerce, um, I took part in a national competition that the Bank of Ireland organises. So it um, involves uh, 1,500 uh, other university uh, students participating in a trading competition. So for a five-week period, uh, 1,500 students trade um, currency pairs. Um, on, on the live markets with live pricing and after the five week period whoever is has returned the most money from the fictitious amount you're given uh, was the winner so that happened to be me um, so I returned just over 48 percent during a five week period um, I was the national winner for that and as a result I, I received 1500 euro as a cash prize and then I was also awarded an internship on Ireland's largest trading floor in uh, the Bank of Ireland in Dublin for the summer, um, which was a really unforgettable experience. Um, and of course, it really, it, it's really helped me now to develop connections in, in an important area um, where I want to maybe do my placement into the future. And that really was um, all due to what I learned in commerce and the interests I had and the, the great support network I had, be it through my lecturers or through my friends in the course. It's hard to believe, Callum, that that was a year ago. It seems like just a few weeks ago we were talking about that award in our economics module in, in First Com. And again, many congratulations on that. And Kerry, could I just end on a final note and ask you, would you recommend the BCom program to prospective students? I absolutely would. Um, it's a fantastic opportunity. Um, and in UCC in particular, the, the BCom program is, is recognized. There's also things like the, the Commerce Society, which was excellent. Um, I made a ton of friends. To this day, my, my friends are from the BCom program in UCC. Um, and again, kind of the resources that are available to you, as I said, you know, a couple of years down the line, um, it was quite a while ago now when I was in UCC and I still have those contacts from UCC. So there's, there's ongoing to support to both current students and graduates who have come from UCC and you know that's something that's something to be really proud of. Fantastic. Now, Kerry we've great evidence of that because we're delighted to have Kerry's younger sister currently yes. in our BCom program so that's quite a recommendation and thank you Kerry. Thank you. Um, I'd just like to, to end on a final note Callum and you know it wasn't too long ago that you were in Leaving Cert yourself and trying to make decisions and our current Leaving Cert's have a lot of pressure at the moment because they're trying to come to terms with a brand new learning environment. They're trying to study hard without the normal social interactions that they would have benefited from. And they're also trying to make decisions as regards third level programs. Have you any advice for them 
and any advice on how to make the best decision for them? Sure. So I would say um, that the most important thing when you're looking at college courses is to stay broad. Um, if your career is going to be over 40 years, you don't want to be specializing right at the start and you especially don't want to decide maybe what you're going to end up in an area field before you're 20. So picking something that has a broad range of options and can really put you into many fields of work after you graduate, like commerce is something that's really worthwhile in, into looking at. Um, I think it's really important not to specialize too early. Um, and then once you go into college, you know, dive right in. Um, I've made some invaluable friends for life through the course. Um, and I think that's, that's one of the greatest things of college so far, just the friends and opportunities from that too. Fantastic. Thank you, Callum. And I wish you all the success in your forthcoming exams as well. And um, I think a very important point that Callum and Kerry both made was, let's say, their, their new love for IS and the different IS and data analysis modules you would have taken in the BCom program. And throughout the BCom program, modules on process are taught to help in collecting, organizing, and analyzing business information to enhance managerial decision making and problem solving for a company. This process, whichever of our fantastic um, employment led majors you select, enables you to become an independent critical thinker, an analysis of business information, a problem solver, and overall a graduate with the skills and abilities to transform the future of our business environment. I would like to thank Kerry and Callum for engaging in the second series of our BCom convention. Thank you so much. As always, if students have any queries, please don't hesitate to email us at the email address that's now coming up on screen, bcomdirector at ucc.ie, and we will get straight back to you. And here's looking forward to series number three.